Hey Bill, I thought I'd try to take a little bit of a walk around video of the Roadmaster for you. So you get an idea of the condition it's in. I think it was stored in the carport because the fake wood on the sides is in good shape, but you can see the fake wood on the back is faded. Coming around the side here, there's a little bit of a dent in the trim right there. And you can see the previous owner put a lot of screws in the rubber trim to reattach it. Same thing here. Small dent in the metal trim right there. I might try to see if they have them at the junkyard. They have one 1991 in there. Come around here, the paint is still very, very presentable. That's why I think it was kept under cover. Got a reasonable shine to it. Down up under here, there's a dent in the bottom of the bumper cover. You kind of have to be down low to see it. And then back here, there's just a little bit of a push in dent right there where that trim is. You saw the inside pretty much in the uh, pictures. I have that little button right there. I have to pop it back in place. Here's the back. I'm trying to go quickly because I don't have much storage room on my phone and I'm afraid it's gonna run out. Got the awesome Brady Bunch third row seat and the gate that opens two different ways. Let me see if I can start it up for you real quick. Starts right up, runs really quiet. You can see it's got great oil pressure. The airbag connection underneath the steering column is disconnected. I think the previous owner might have been afraid of uh, it blowing up in their face. So that's what that warning light is right there. Dash is all in excellent condition. Open the hood for you. I hope this isn't too nauseating. Here's the motor, just plain old Chevy. It's got a re, uh, newer radiator in it. Reman AC compressor. AC works really good. Now I'm gonna pop it in the gear, and normally when it's cold, it works just fine. See how it's holding an idle there? Oh, now it's starting to drop a little bit. That's the issue I have to fix. That should be that IAC sensor. See that little stumble and then it picks back up again? That seems to be the only mechanical issue the car has. Doors all closed nice and solid. Look at that, even the hood light works. Amazing. I'm going to try to email this to you or I may have to upload it onto YouTube.
I'll see what happens. I'm not the best when it comes to these things. All right. 